Okay, now you classes. are ready. For what? Uh, for explain how to prepare firewood. <laughs> and maybe tonight you can show... How to prepare firewood? Yeah, and you can show how to make fire. Okay, well, first of all, I try to do it the lazy way. <laughs> <laughs> so, but I'll explain that. So, uh, out here it's kind of hard to find dry seasoned wood. It's just everything's either damp or rotten. But um, if you look out in the woods and you find uh, where a tree has fallen previously, but the branches are still have it, it hasn't totally rot, rotted and deteriorated to where it's completely laying on the ground, but it's fallen over, clearly been dead for a really long time. Um, so there are some down here in this like gully. Uh, those are, it's easier to, to take wood off of that. Um, because it'll break apart very easily, but it's it's very dry. Uh, so I use either the axe or the, the handsaw to take that off, and then I bring it up here. Most a little bit I've already processed. Mostly I've just got little stuff right now because we're not going to make a huge fire tonight. Um, tonight's our last night here, so we just I just want a little bit to, to for tonight. Um, but then I try to find like a, a fork tree like this, close to wherever my fire pit is. And I just use that and just use the leverage to, instead of having to chop and saw every one of these, um, I just try to use the leverage. This one's a little thicker, so it might not work. But most of that stuff down there, I already processed. But I can at least show you what I mean. So I just kind of stick it between as far as you can. And give it a little, give it a little tug. Oh. See, this one. You want to be careful so it doesn't snap back and hit you, but uh, this one's a little too thick, so I'll probably use the axe on this. But if it's thinner than that, you can just, which is what I did down there with all that wood. So this is the stuff that's left that I'll probably take the axe to or uh, my hand saw. Um, I need a good uh, buck saw or like a bow saw right now. I just have kind of a hand saw. Um, uh, I think I have a Corona. A lot of people use the, oh, I already forgot what the other one was called, but anyway, uh, uh, I'll probably just use that to process the rest of this down. But most of the time, it's a fork like this, it's, especially if it's longer and real dry, this pine is real flexible, but the hardwood, the hardwood will just snap. But uh, anyway, yeah, that's the easy, that's the lazy man's way of doing it. All right, and may, maybe you can explain more. Tonight, when you make fire, always wear gloves and eye protection. That's good. Processing wood. All right, thank you.